video number three using leak detector so I pulled out the drain plug down here this is where the water comes out from under your carpet right down there that goes outside this is where it looks like your car is incompetent and it needs the pens because it's peeing all over the floor and so checking for refrigerant coming out at the bottom there I will be performing the test here I still haven't found anything this is probably a very small leak if it is there this is another way when I know when I'm finished with the Prius this is condensation okay when I do the air conditioning on a Prius since it's usually coming out around 39 degrees most of the time it'll condensate right here where you see the vents blowing on the window and it'll get all wet right here this will all turn into water um, if it's humid out and you charge your Prius correctly you will get this phenomenon happening right here uh, unless you're in the desert and it's only 17% humidity then you won't get that you could go on look on your dew uh, weather forecast look up on your phone and some of the better ones will give you your dew point and you know when that will happen like that so so far using the UV light you know the UV light of course dye will not work on a leak like that because it was a slow accumulating over a long time so never expect that you're gonna put in dye and you're gonna condemn a leak that's slow like that unless these leaks are really big they won't show nothing which they're not showing anything even though it looks and appears like there's been a big oil residue buildup right there and leakage for sure I know I have this leak still searching under the dash for evaporator leak both fans are operating perfectly so it appears unless I find a trace of a leak coming from under the dash I will be recommending these two o-rings that used to be a problem years ago and this one's just showing up now so those o-rings on the liquid line will be replaced the ones on the suction line will be replaced <clears throat> since I know this place this uh, car goes off-road and hits a lot of dirt and debris that dust buildup could have been from when it was wetter and it went through dust and mud and it built up there so I do not want to falsely diagnose that I've been trying to stick my leak detector down there looking for leaks I've been running this vehicle and um, I cannot pick up a leak down there so unless I find otherwise in the next 20 or 30 minutes I'm going to just condemn those two o-rings right there fill it up and send the customer on their way it has trace dye in the system now so if there is a leak at the condenser it will get condemned later on if there is a leak at the evaporator that we can't pick up right now with the electronic leak detector then it'll come back and when we open up the case or if it gets bigger we will definitely see the evidence of a leak that's it for now i'll do a recovery on this one they'll perform their repairs and be on their merry way and come back at a later time.